flowchart welcomes you to the recruiting process flowchart of r -Light. The presentation overview contains flowcharts, recruitment process to search applicant, recruitment process to search requirement, recruitment process after immediate login, recruitment process to search applicant flowchart, start recruiting, search applicant, search requirement, open application, call log, start applicant approval, ready for submission, submission made, onboarded. Recruitment process to search applicants search as an existing applicant with the help of any given criteria such as first or last name, city or even postal code. Step 1. Enter or copy and paste the URL link in the address bar and you will be redirected to the login page. On the right side top, you will see the login button. Click on login button and you will be redirected to the username and password page. Enter your username and password and click login button. Step 2. Once you log into the application, you'll be able to view the dashboard and the tabs above it. This is where the actual process starts. Click Start Recruiting. Step 3. Once you click Start Recruiting, the tab will take you to the next page where you can choose the way you want to proceed. Either choose Search Applicant or Search Requirement. Let's proceed with Search Applicant. Step 4. Click on Search Applicant. Enter the required information. Click Submit and scroll to view the applicant's list. Applicant list is displayed below. Step 5. Select an applicant from the list of applicants. Select the one which you are searching. Click on the applicant's name to view the applicant's information. And now you can view the applicant's information beneath. Step 6. Click on search requirement. After clicking the search requirement tab, enter the required information in the appropriate field for searching a requirement for the applicant. Click submit. Step 7. Job requirement list will appear after clicking the submit button. Once the list of requirement is displayed, click on the job ID to view the entire requirement information. Step 8. After clicking the job ID, scroll down to see detailed view of the requirement where we'll be able to view everything regarding a particular requirement like the job title, skill needed, project duration, etc. Click open application to enter call log page. Step 9. In the call log page, the requirement details and the applicant details are displayed side by side for the HR user to match and compare. Click Start Applicant Approval to send an automated mail to the applicant. Step 10. Applicant will receive a mail along with two links to confirm or to reject the requirement, to search and apply for a new requirement. Step 11. Once the applicant confirms, his application will be sent to the ready for submission from there, the HR user can send the applicant's information to the client to compose mail. Step 12. The list of all the applicants can sent to the client can be viewed in the Submission Made tab and the applicant can be onboarded once he is selected by the client from this tab itself. Recruitment Process to Search Requirement Flowchart Start Recruiting Search Requirement Search Applicant Open Application Call Log Start applicant approval, ready for submission, submission made on boarded. Recruitment process through search requirement helps to search a job requirement by a client or job opening. Step 1. Enter or copy and paste the URL link in the address bar and you will be redirected to the login page. On the right side top, you will see the login button. Click on login button and you will be redirected to the username and password page. Enter your username and password and click login button. Step 2. Once you log into the application, you will be able to view the dashboard and the tabs above it. This is where the actual process starts. Click Start Recruiting. Step 3. Once you click Start Recruiting tab, it will take you to the next page where you can choose the way you want to proceed, either choose Search Applicant or Search Requirement. Let's proceed with Search Requirement. Step 4. In the Search Requirement tab, enter the required information in the fields. Click Submit. Step 5. You will see a list of requirements after clicking Submit button. Choose the required job ID and click Job ID to view the detailed information. Step 6. Here appears a detailed job information. Click on Search Applicant. Enter the keyword which are to be searched in the required field and click Submit. Step 7. Once you click Submit, the applicant list will appear. Choose the applicant and click on the first name to view detailed applicant's information. Step 8. Once you finalize the applicant, click Open Application to start the mapping process. Step 9. 
Once the applicant is finalized completely, send the intimation mail to the applicant for the job requirement along with your comments by clicking on Start Applicant Approval. Step 10. Applicant will receive a mail along with two links to confirm or to reject the requirement, to search and apply for a new requirement. Step 11. Once the applicant confirms, his application will be sent to the ready for submission. From there, the HR user can send the applicant's information to the client through composed mail. From ready for submission, we can send the intimation to client. Step 12. After confirmation from the client is received, applicant status can be changed to onboard if the applicant is employed by clicking on submission made menu and under application name by clicking on board tab. Recruitment process after immediate login flowchart. Applicant submits resume. HR user logs in. Dashboard appears. Open application. Call log. Start applicant approval. Ready for submission. Submission made. Onboarded. Step 1. Enter or copy and paste the URL link in the address bar and you will be redirected to the login page. On the right side top, you will see the login button. Click on login button and you will be redirected to the username and password page. Enter your username and password and click login button. Step 2. Our Lights dashboard appears. Click on Today menu under View Application to view today's submission of resume. Step 3. You are viewing the application received for a particular job title. Click on the menu below Call Log. Step 4. Once the applicant is finalized completely, send the intimation mail to the applicant for the job requirement, along with your comments by clicking on Start Applicant Approval. Step 5. Applicant will receive a mail along with two links to confirm or to reject the requirement, to search and apply for a new requirement. Step 6. Once the applicant confirms, his application will be sent to the ready for submission. From there, the HR user can send the applicant's information to the client through composed mail. From ready for submission, we can send the information to client. Step 7. After confirmation from the client is received, Applicant status can be changed to onboard if the applicant is employed by clicking on Submission Made menu and under Application Name by clicking on Board tab. Thanks for watching the video.